Hi, I'm Mike Fenegrassi from the Ash Academy of Sports Medicine, and I want to talk to you about the slastic loop and a way you can use this to do some tube walking. Uh, so for this one, what we're going to do is place it around the ankles of the client. And again, these are real easy to put on. It's one of the reasons I like this. If you have hair on your legs, it's not going to rip it out. We'll have the client place their hands on their hips. And really the key points to this one is that we want to stay pretty level with the hips, have them drive that foot out and take small steps under, under control. And then come back the other way. We would typically do about 12 to 20 repetitions of these one to three sets. Now the common mistakes we see when people are doing tube walking or uh, using some type of thing like a loop is they'll start to hike their hips as they're doing it and they'll rock. Another thing we'll see is they'll turn that foot out as they're doing it or they'll try to take too big of a step or go too fast. So the key with this one is small controlled movements really trying to target the muscle up here in the hip that we're looking to engage. So that's just one of the things that you can use this loop for and one of the things that we like to use it for at NESM. Thank you.